Hi folks, welcome back to Vampire. Dan here with No Games for Old Men, and we are entering the Ascalon Club, but once again, hoping to find Lord Redgrave and get that drop of William Marshall's Sir, blood. You are not welcome. Oh no. We have to find a way around. Can I get up on the roof of the entry? No. Oh, oh no. Oh no, what do I do? Okay, maybe this back alley here. Maybe if I can get in through the back door of the place? Perhaps? Keeping an eye out for open windows. Breaks in the wall. Who's this person? Unknown. Hey! New person. Good evening, miss. Can I help you? I'm a doctor. Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am... I am... Karina Billow. Are you sure? I don't need any doctor. The rats. Where are the rats? Miss, you don't I seem well at all. all. Are you afraid of rats? Has one bitten you? No. It's me who bites them. <laughs> Tasty, juicy, disgusting rats. I can't stop eating them. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, please, yes. help me to disobey the voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. Oh, she's healthy. Okay, well, uh, let's talk to her. Have you recent news of Aloysius Dawson? He is dead, I've heard. I wish I was dead too. Oh no, we gotta fix this. Tell me about yourself, Miss Billow. What do you do for a living? She eats rats. I'm hungry. I need to eat. Have you got something for me? Blood, perhaps? Can you give me blood, Dr. Reed? Don't you remember who you are, Miss? Is she an Econ and what doesn't you know you did it? for work? I was strong, proud. I campaigned for good causes. But that was before. Before. It does not matter anymore. I'm so hungry. Hmm. What happened to you? The rats. <laughs> the answer hides in their little crunchy bones. <laughs> their juicy, <laughs> tiny brains. Miss Billow, oh please God. try to concentrate. Oh, that is amazing. Why do you worry about rats so much? The voice in my head. He forces me to do so. Drink their blood, he said. Eat their flesh. Do you feel compelled to obey that voice, Miss Billow? Even if you're loath to submit to it? Yes. Please. Help. This is interesting. I wonder if someone's mesmerized her and is just messing with her. Or if she's a, an Econ and doesn't know it. Tell me about the voice in your head. Who is it? Can you describe it? Is it someone you know? Someone you met? Keep your mouth shut, he said. Don't ever speak about me or I'll abandon you. Help me, please, Doctor. Interesting. What is the local news hereabouts, Miss Billow? Shadows. Shadows hunting shadows. Whispers in the dark. Pestilence. Suffering. Death. She's fun, huh? Ooh. Need hints about her. Well, we'll I have must to go find now. out more about Goodbye, her some Ms. other Bill. way. Um. Let's see. I know this isn't the way I want to go. I'm just. Coming up here, let's see if there's another. Because I know there's one more person in this region that I haven't met yet, so I thought maybe there would be a, a door over there. Yes, yes, life, oh, poor lady. <laughs> okay, so here is the back entrance to the Ascalon Club. So I think if I go in there, maybe I'll have some better luck. Uh, but first we're going to... What is this? Oh, I think that was... It's locked. 
remember where that went. That must be where I rescued Louise Teasdale, I think. Okay. No new people, so I don't know where that last person is. Okay, well, let's boogie back around to the gate, go into the back garden of the Ascalon Club, and see if we can gain entry through here. This isn't really very nice, is it? Well, I guess it would be. You know, get some... Some trees and... I don't know, it just seems dirty to me. They're not, they're not keeping it up. Oh boy. Okay. Just walk right on in, I guess. Man, I'm gonna have to fight a bunch of vampires, aren't I? I'm still persona non grata in the Ascalon Club. If I want to speak with Lord Redgrave, I'll have to improvise. Put on a costume. Is there anybody here? You cannot win this. Oh. Yeah. Oh no! It's the it's it's the guy with the white. Oh god! He's wrecking me already. Oh my gosh! Really? Did nothing to him? I don't understand. I really don't. He's not. Okay, that did something. But I honestly, I don't get how sometimes the the shadow mist doesn't do any damage to them, even when they're not um, resistant to it. Ooh. Nope. See? See? That did nothing. He didn't get out of it. It just... It just did nothing. Oh, come on. Try it again. Okay, that that damaged him. Oh. The biggest damage that I'm doing is with that Shadow Mist, though, so I've got to keep trying it. See, that did a good chunk. Oops. Oh. 
I totally just blanked on the, the key I needed to press there. And I did the wrong one. <laughs> I had four options and I, I blew it. Oh! I swear, dodging to the left just does not work for me. There we go. Dead. Nice. Okay, now he didn't have a name though. So that concerns me. He was not Lord such and such. Uh, which means there's more. He said I have to improvise, but... Improvise... What? Oh, there's somebody in here. Oh, there he is! It's weird. Um... Good evening, Lord Redgrave. What are you doing here, traitor? I shall smite you for this audacity. I'm not here to bicker, Lord Redgrave. I can put an end to this epidemic, but I need your assistance to do so. Good. We've held out thus far, but the time has come to put an end to this crisis. Tell me, what do you need? The blood of William Marshall. The blood of William Marshall? Of my maker? Are you mad? This blood is the purest of all. My maker profited to me on the battlefield. I cannot hand it to you. Stop this farce. Marshall never was your maker. I have no idea how you acquired his blood, but I need it now. I see. Well, in that case, given the gravity of the situation, I suppose I can spare you a drop. Thank you, my lord. If you manage to save this city, you'll prove yourself a veritable servant of the crown. So Godspeed, Dr. Reed. Our fate lies wholly in your hands. Completely unexpected. Did not think that that would go that way. Well... I've been down here already. I don't think there's going to be anything new. But since we're here, let's just see. Would be nice if we found that last braille page down here. Nope. Bummer. Okay, so now we need to go find McCullum and get the drop of King Arthur's blood. Hopefully, because we spared him, the conversation will go much like that of the one I just had with Redgrave. Hopefully. So, let's see, what's my best path to get there? Oh, so far away. I guess we'll just go take as straight a path as we can. Every time I take a shotgun blast in the face. Ooh. Look at you standing up with one hit point. Oh, 
Whoops. Ooh. Good thing I missed. He would have parried that. A little bit turned around here, but... Just follow the compass, Mark. Gosh, there's a theater again. Not a safe place right now, sir. See you in clothes. This one's a fire. Fortunately, those guys stagger with the the heavy mace. Not so much with the brawlers. Oh, hello. Oops. Oops, I, I walked in there too soon. I thought it had dissipated enough. Where the there's a couple of echons here. No? Ooh, they've been replaced. Alright, well, I don't want to tangle with a preacher, so we're just gonna sneak right on by. Since we're getting close enough to our goal here. I was behind him. Come on. Come on. 
I guess I was close enough to the, uh, the cone of fire there. Okay. It was fun that he was in the middle of combat and just musing while he was <laughs> attacking dudes. Where's that guy? Where's that guy's corpse? Ooh, rat! I can't believe I'm doing this. Yes, you can. You and Miss Billums, you're. Oh, he's around here somewhere. Okay, so we are in the cemetery. We are approaching the cemetery. Are those rats too? Well, we know where we are, don't we? Has Mary been... Mary hasn't been buried? Reburied yet? Gee whiz. Alright. Maybe McCollum's up here. Because this is where... I thought this was an interesting area, but it, there wasn't anything up here. So maybe I can get through... No. Okay. Not so much. Here's the Paxtons. another one. Who's this? Dyson. Where are you, Jeffrey? Hear any voices speaking? That would be one clue. Oh, hello. in for a strike and came up just short with my face right in his barrel. Oops. Okay, well, the fact that these guys were here, does that mean Jeffrey's nearby? Where could he be?
Wow, double miss. Oops. Gadzooks. Yeah, there's a skull right there. Two of them, and you couldn't be bothered to take them out. Resisting too. Uh oh. There we go. She wins. Well, my thought was maybe he was in this building, but... I don't... I guess he might be. He be. I feel like I've been all over the cemetery. Must be missing something. It's the front gate. Nope. He's not one of these guys. This is where Xiao Shun was. It's locked. Hmm. Well, he's not here either. Nuts. Let's 
kind of a cool screenshot, though. Boop. Actually, I gotta angle it up a bit, don't I? Boop. So I don't have the compass in it. All right, Jeffrey, I'm getting a little tired of, of looking for you. Where... Where are you? I feel like I'm going around in circles now. Ooh, nice. Free bullets. Am I even in the right place? Yeah. Yes, I am. Definitely in the right place. He is in the cemetery somewhere. Why, though? Why would he be in the cemetery? What's he doing? Did I just come from here? Yes. Yes, Dan, you did just come from here. Blood trails, there's no interactables. Except for the Paxton sister graves. Oh! Did I walk right past him? Oh my god, I feel like an idiot. Good evening, vampire hunter. Are you here to end me, Leech? You'll find I will not be killed easily. Not at all, McCullum. I am here because I need you. Really? I'm intrigued. Speak up, then. I need the blood of a king. The blood of Arthur. I'm certain you possess it, and I must have it. The guard's most sacred and precious relic. Why would you... Ah. Uh, you found Marshall's memoirs. I should have destroyed that book. I need the antidote to save this city, McCollum. It is within me to take your words as truth. I want to, but I must know more. What precisely are your plans? I feel like he will be more willing to help me if I tell him that I'm. I need to destroy it a monster rather than the epidemic. A creature called a disaster is about to be unleashed. It falls upon me, as once it did Marshall, to stop it before the whole country is ravaged. I should have destroyed that book. And yet, I wish I could join this battle alongside you. You can! Help me but out! this crusade is not mine to fight. Do you not understand? We wanted the same thing from the outset. A means to end this vampire epidemic. Not enemies. Maybe that is so. Take it then. I see no other hope for this city. If this is some trick, you will be damned, Dr. Reed. There it is. Thank you. Can we speak more? Indeed. Why not? Why are you here? The man who raised me after the brutal murder of my parents. He's buried here. Were both your parents killed by vampires? Yes. And yet worse. My father returned to Dublin a vampire. And tore out my mother's throat. Oh, jeez. And who was this man? Carl Eldritch. One-time leader of Prewin. We've, uh... He killed my father in front of me. 
Help me hunt my brother Ain after teaching me how to kill leeches. We've read quite a few of his documents. What will the guard of Prewen do now? Will you stop the great hunt? Yes. But we shall continue to protect innocents from beasts like you and your red-headed friend. Like me? I am indebted to you for sparing me at Pembroke. But this won't always be the case. I'm no coward like those St. Paul's Stoll brothers. How long have you known Lady Ashbury? Where is she? And what will you do to her? We saw you meeting her, so of course we investigated. But she is gone. Our scouts reported she has sold some paintings and departed for an unknown destination. Hmm. All right, I guess that... Adieu, ends vampire that. hunter. Until we meet again, blood drinker. Find a hideout to create the antidote. Well, we know where one is. Should I do it at the hospital or at the one that's here in the cemetery? Whoops. Okay, here we go. Creating the antidote. The blend seems stable. Time to go and find Harriet in the sewers. Guinea pig? <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, let's refill. Way over on the other side of the docks. Been down there? I don't even know. It's a transition, though. I don't need to transition. Oh, but what if it contains the the Braille notes? Actually, I'll probably get in here and realize exactly where I am and know that I don't need to be down here. It's just bothering me that there's that one side quest that I haven't been able to complete. Stonebridge sewers, though. I don't remember what I was down here for. Must have been something. Oh, here we go. They're all going to be that easy to dispatch. 
Maybe we will explore down here a bit. <gasps> Ooh, extermination of rodents. Ah. Hello? Uh-oh. There's construction in the hallway. There we go. Extermination of rodents. Here we go. No mercy. No excuse. No forgiveness. These are the simple rules all members of the club shall apply when dealing with skulls. Whenever you face one, exterminate it. Whenever you suspect a vampire of creating a skull, creating skulls, report him immediately to Fergal Bansha and to myself. Skulls are a permanent threat to us. For these despicable creatures have no control of their appetite or their primitive instincts. The only case when a skull can be momentarily spared is as long as he can provide us really useful information on our projects. In any other cases, London must be cleansed of these disgusting rodents. From the Law of Ascalon by Lord Redgrave, Founder. Werewolf snuck up behind him. Oh, he's wrecking me. Okay, at least we're getting some good crafting materials out of this. Where I came? I think I just made a circle. Yeah, I did. Okay, so. There we go. Is this the way out? Oh! Nice. Oh my gosh! Uh, you hesitated. He had the drop on me, but he hesitated. It ain't you! Uh. Christ, he's dead! Wow. You both are. Oh, no loot on you, though. Okay, so this is the other side. soon because there's construction going on in the hallway and loud so Jonathan is angry. <coughs> oh, here's the 
hospital. Let's see, I've got 2,000 experience points. Is that enough to do anything? It might be. But before I do that, I would probably want to make sure that I can... Uh, apply some medication to people who need it. Like this guy and her. Bronchitis. Oh my gosh. Oh, I've got some bronchitis cures. That's good. Headache. Let's get one of those. Migraine. I don't know if anybody had that. Oh, weapons. Weapon upgrades. We want to do this. Incendiary. Excellent. Okay, now this is fully upgraded. What about the Lepara? Or a uh, Parabellum. So I need four more. And one rivet. Oh no! Oh, I, I can do the rivet. Any reason to do this? I don't want to waste materials. Uh, okay, so we've got a we've got a couple of people who are ill here in the hospital, so we can go down, give them some treatment, and then go to a hideout and evolve. Probably what might be for the last time. I feel like this is a I feel like we're in the end game now. So Pippa was one of them. She's usually around here, I think. Oops. Oh, I just saw. There she is. This dead flesh needs it. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening, Doctor Reed. Do you need medical help yourself, Nurse? I'm afraid I've contracted some illness, Doctor Reed. Not under my watch, Nurse. Take this. You'll feel better. Thank you, Doctor Reed. Goodbye, Nurse Hawkins. Okay, so she is healing now. Whoop! And Tippets has a headache. Get him going. Good evening, Dr. Tippets. Dr. Reed, any good news to share? Do you need any medical assistance yourself, Doctor? Yes, indeed. But don't worry, I am perfectly capable of taking care of myself. I have no doubt about it, but you are still ill all the same. Please, take this medicine. I appreciate your concern, Dr. Reed. To be honest, I just did not take the time to diagnose myself. Goodbye, Dr. Tippetts. Okay, so that is both people in the hospital district that were ill. The docks, let's see. Really, nobody is ill in the docks. Or Whitechapel. So everyone who's ill is back here in the West End. Nuts, I've already left. Fatigue, headache, they're all like single uh, first tier illnesses too. Oh, poo. Well, you know what? We've got a problem to resolve. So we're going to go to this dock uh, hideout area. Cannot enter. Nope. It's locked, all right. Rats.
Poison. I was out of blood, I couldn't autophagy. Well, that was embarrassing. Four of them now. I thought they were gonna. Okay. We have to stop it. Filthy murdering bastard. He's dead. I was going to harvest from that guy, but I heard him too bad. Okay, so I need to go this way. There we go. I knew there was a, a way down from there. Shortcut. Oh no. Vampires. Oh, there's two of them. Gosh. Oh no. I have no way of healing. Oh. I need to. There we go. Good grief. He just completely ignored that that damage. Stupid newborn. Oh, that's gonna stop right now. I don't care. Couldn't land that stake. Very messy. All right, we are approaching our destination. I don't need blood. <laughs> now I do. <laughs> this guy just took me off my feet. Oh my gosh, get me again.
Okay. Well, that was fun. Um, I don't think I'm going the right direction. My hideout is through here. Oh. There's quite a melee going on over there. Okay, we're going to have to go through this werewolf to get to the hideout, which is right up there. Unless I can jump up there without him seeing me. Maybe I can take him. Oh! Wow, that was awesome. Okay, workbench. I don't need to make any of those. Oh, here we go. Oh, I need one more watery, sturdy blood sample. Poo. Alright, well, I'm not going to get any of that from... the... stuff I've got in my pockets. I don't think I need to replenish, but we'll do it anyway. Okay, what can I upgrade for just 2,000 XP? Bite damage. I could do. Bite healing. I could do. I could do one of the one or the other. Um, I could do this. But then do I have enough resources to make more serums? That would just be a waste of... I could do this, that would help me... ...carry more bullets. 10%? That's not much. 300, 300... So that's 600 to be able to carry 20% more bullets. Uh, Blood Cauldron, which I really never use. Yeah, I don't even have enough to upgrade that once. Uh, spring? I could do Spring. Because I use that a lot. And that would triple the amount of damage it does. Then oh, that's a thousand. That's what I just clicked on. What if it was six hundred? It was these two together. Okay, so now I can carry 20% more bullets. Oops, nope, we don't wanna... There we go. And it looks like that just immediately... Oop. Okay, no new illnesses there. <sighs> Whole bunch more illnesses at Pembroke. Man, that was sanitized before, and now they're almost at half. No new illnesses there. Okay, there's still two people at West End that I just haven't met. Okay, well... That's that. Next episode, we're going to go into the sewers and see if we can find Harriet Jones, who might be the disaster? I don't know. We'll find out. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Vampire. Hope you're enjoying it. Hope you're having a great day, staying safe and healthy. Thanks so much for watching. I botched that. 
Thanks so much for watching. <laughs>